Hello, dear traders. My name is Clara, and these are the main trading ideas for the current trading session. First of all, let's discuss the situation with oil. WDI oil is trading at $67.40 per barrel. Earlier, Israel's missile attack did not affect either the oil production or nuclear infrastructure of the Islamic Republic, and, apparently, the damage from it was insignificant. Experts note that the Iranian leadership is unlikely to take any retaliatory steps. Thus, the risks of interruptions in supplies to the Middle East oil market have significantly decreased, putting pressure on quotes. Additional pressure on oil is exerted by the plans of OPEC plus countries to increase oil production by 180,000 barrels per day starting in December, which may cause a supply surplus on the global market. Given this, the decline in oil may continue. Next dollar against Japanese yen. The pair is trading at 152.80. The Bank of Japan will hold a meeting on Thursday. According to analysts, the regulator will not change monetary parameters and will keep the rate at the previous level of 0.25%. According to data published last week, the consumer price index in Tokyo was below 2% for the first time in several months, which may become another argument against raising the key interest rate. Additional pressure on the yen is being exerted by the results of Sunday's elections. Thus, the ruling Liberal Democratic Party of Japan lost its parliamentary majority, which increased uncertainty about the composition of the next government. Analysts recommend holding long positions on the pair. And finally, euro against the dollar. The pair is trading near 1.0800. Yesterday, Representatives of the German concern Volkswagen AG announced that they are considering the possibility of closing three plants in Germany in the near future, cutting the number of jobs, reducing wages at enterprises by 10%, and abandoning their indexation in 2025 and 2026. These plans were the result of weak sales of products combined with rising costs of electricity, materials, and labor, which significantly reduced the company's profit. Similar problems affect other German industrial enterprises, the deterioration of whose situation puts additional pressure on the Eurozone economy. Given this, the Euro retains the potential for decline. So, these are the main trading ideas for now. Thank you for your attention, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.